There's considerable context to this all-smiles chat between Terunofuji and Abi. The two are much better friends than is often let on, to the extent that after this violent affair, Terunofuji pulled Abi aside and calmly said, I'll teach you how to push better. And the result, exactly eight weeks later, was this. though somewhat aided by Tedu's injured ankle. The Yokozuna was dolloping out the advice to half a dozen men on the tour last week, much as Hakuho was in 2019. It demonstrates his grasp of a Yokozuna's role in raising the overall wrestling level, the Nikkan Gendai reported last week but it also conveys Teru's race against time. The next tour is still two tournaments away, and he can't guarantee he'll be on it. What he needs to convey with a healthy frame, he must convey now. There's a layered context to this scene too. A greeting involving a Yokozuna is a staid and formal affair, usually. But the mutual respect among these two men is the strongest Sumo produces. As the only two men who held nothing back whenever and wherever we trained, we noticed each other early on, wrote Terunofuji in his book. We were bold and fearless against everyone. I've always found Takayasu a gutsy wrestler well worthy of my respect. Takayasu's tribute in that same book reads as follows. His Haruma Fuji was my Kisenosato. We both had a Yokozuna mentor, we both felt spotlighted, and were therefore, I feel, hell-bent on matching each other. We could each feel how ardently the other wanted to rise. Fighting each other in that same environment has formed a key part of my sumo sustenance. An unbreakable bond indeed. So how's Terunofuji performing these days? We know he went to Tokitsukaze stable on April 26th and fought 11 bouts against Shodai and visiting Asanoyama, though the score is not known. It was important to use different muscles against different types of wrestlers he said on the tour some four days later. They're all invited to my place, by the way, but nobody ever comes, he chuckled. He thus took himself to Arashio Stable on Wednesday, May the 3rd, for a workout with Wakamoto Haru, thrashing him 8-2 to two, and even resisting his full-on drives with famed inside left. I was testing the extent to which I could move. I think I'm shaping up well, Teru said. I've got to build up a body which can deal with any position. Nevertheless, he admits that he's rarely as satisfied as he was in days of yore. The knees won't grant him that pleasure. At the multi-stable practice before the Yokozuna Council the following day, Teru repeated his score of 8 and 2 against Kiribayama, Dai Esho, Shodai, and, in perhaps a baton handover, Kinbozan. He praised Kiribayama for defeating him once and described him as harder to push around. And as for himself, he added, it doesn't feel bad at all. Let's recall he was almost ready for March, and has trained solidly since then. I don't think he'll be where he was before, but he's coming back into shape, 
said Sumo Chairman Hakkaku. I expect him to do all right in May, and Wakamoto Haru clearly does too. But Sumo Chiefs have been looking ahead for much of his leave of absence. Look at their new snacks package design. Someone important is missing.